Well, I'm sure most of us have been playing the Dragon's Delight event, whether a little bit or a lot. But today, I'm actually just going to be showing you all of the stuff that I did in this Dragon's Delight event sped up. And then we will see where we end up by the end in terms of our placement. Here is to hoping, by some miracle, that we can make it on the leaderboard top three, somehow. Well, with one more reset to go, we are currently in first position, but to be honest, I doubt that we're going to hold that because I can only get one more reset, same as everyone else, but I don't trust these events at all. Unless I have like a 500, 600 lead, I, d I don't trust it. Don't give me false hope, game. Please. <laughs> Please don't do me like this. Um, but, you know, I think that this event as it is, is fine now because they have made quite a few changes to the Dragon's Delight and I like it like this. Like, if you are pretty decent at throwing in the items during the Frenzy time frame, then the event is very doable. You can get the Reward Dragon, at least, 
the only problem really is the uh, the leaderboard dragon, which, you know, grand majority of players are not going to get it because only the top three in each bracket can actually get that leaderboard dragon. And it just means that a lot of the time, lots of whales end up coming out and just stealing it from under your nose. So yeah, that can suck and it's probably going to happen to me too. But, you know, I'm expecting it at this point. I'm, uh, <laughs> I'm not going to put my ho or hold my hopes up and at least I can be happy that I got an, a new dragon out of this. Well, I say a new dragon, a new dragon for me because I didn't have Greener Gate before. It's just when you are in the middle of doing frenzy stuff and then you unlock one of the rewards and then it tries to take you out of the screen, it just really messes with me. Like, I, I wish it wouldn't do it while I'm in the middle of like trying to throw my items at my dragons during like a frenzy because it just completely throws me off. I think that's just a personal gripe. It's not a big issue or anything like that. Ah uh, no, why does it always turn on during bosses? Oh, goodness. I worked it out that this auto, auto battle bug always happens during a sigil map, map battle boss fight. And that's why it keeps turning on all the time, which is just really annoying, to be honest. Like, really, really annoying. But anyway, we finished. I have not been focusing on this very much. I've ba mainly just been logging in for the uh, the Sigil stuff. I mean, the, the Dragon's Delight stuff. This is Sigil, fifth, whatever. We're going to get taken out of that position. I don't care too much anyway. But of course, we can go back to like a previous battle and try to get the highest score that we possibly can. It's just my team is not really made for it. And because I don't have full epic sigils, we are actually beginning to experience more of the sting now against these enemies as in we can't one shot them like some people can so it is what it is i'm not too bothered about sigil map anymore like i've lost interest in sigils completely in this game so for now i guess we will wait and see what happens one more reset i will get the breeding points for this uh event as well and i think that's gonna Pretty much, we're just going to have to leave our hands in the hands of fate. But at the very least, as long as we can get some enchantment tickets, I'll be happy. If we can somehow have an inactive bracket, that would be lovely. But all that we can do for now is pray to our own Jesus. And we only have two more days left of the treasure hunt. And as you can see, I've only just got over 400. So it's... Uh, question is, are we actually going to get 40 amulets or not? Because if our, our luck is average, we should. If we get below average, well, we may very much suck during this event. But I guess this is the end of this week for us. But I wish you the best. I hope that you manage to get your hands on Unlikely if you're going for it. And we will return next week with probably more Ancient Event news.